seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden, some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years, even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do, and the Templars have the upper hand these days. But something larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. To Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon, though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring, only that this is where they want us to be, when it does. They've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long-lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him, however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. Hello guys, my name is Rally Gameplays and we are going to play some Assassin's Creed 3. It's a game I've been waiting for to play for a very very long time. And so I've played it about five hours. Um it's free play, I play in I have another safe game. I played five hours. And I only completed 16%. 5 hours and only 16%. What the f. Uh, how? But yeah, here we are. Gosh. And I just think all the characters are so fucking ugly in this game. Seriously. Look at. I don't, can't remember her name, but she's Rebecca, I think. But he's fucking ugly. Seriously. And Desmond is, he's, he's like in the first from Assassin's Creed 1 and up to Brother Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, he was like buffed, bigger and not so thin, but here in, oh, it's called Assassin's Creed 3, he's more s tall and skinny and has a weird face, I think, but yeah, whatever. Let's just play the game. Pook. No hope. Let's select this out. <gasps> this man. Open it. Open it. 
amazement. In another moment, down went Alice after it. Never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. Um. Let's go. Let's go, bitch ass. Let's run down here. Hmm? Or not? And yeah, I, you s I, th I know you noticed that I haven't been putting out the Minecraft Advent Calendar, and that's because I, I'm not making any progress in it, and I just, I think Minecraft is just a little out of date for me. So I've, and perhaps it's, and when I normally play Minecraft, I don't, don't know with Ticket, or with Ticket, um, I don't know if it fucks up there but in normal Minecraft and no Minecraft it's like maybe after one or two minutes. You 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 might notice that when I play Minecraft in the latest episode of Advent Cal the Advent Calder, you notice that I sometimes stop the recording for about a minute or two. But that's mostly because it's Minecraft just or Fraps just fucks the whole up the whole thing up when I play it. It's just like after one or two minutes, it's completely lagging. It's so annoying, and it's it it has so it has not something to do with my PC or Minecraft. It because when I normally play Minecraft, it's about those 50, 60, and maybe all up to 200 or not 200, but all up to 100. Nothing to do when I'm not recording, but when I when I am recording. It's on those like it can come all down to those ten five and then the it just lags. But I don't care. Let's play the game. So, um, Sir. what the fuck, Saturday? Here, Here we go, go again. again. So I, I just laughed. This story in this game in Assassin's Creed 3, I just love it. It's more yeah. when I first what played Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, I thought it was amazing. But when I got like so a half me into the in the game, I, don't know, sure I, was okay. I thought oh, this story is so fucking boring. And Besides when I completed the game, you, it's like right, not doing anymore. And just think, right. Assassin's Creed Brotherhood has, has a fucked up story. I more think that Assassin's Creed 2 and Revelation has a much better story. For, so, it's a key. come no on, man, let's is, go to the story. Come in! She triggered the bleeding effect. She. Juno, yeah. Dad. She's talking to me. Oh. Okay, Desmond, while you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. Okay. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. Alright. Mm -hmm. What do you need me to do? Well, start simple. Walk to the marker over there. Let's walk to this marker. Okay, Desmond. Let's practice climbing on these objects. And yeah, I might upload this video to Golden Gameplays HD because my cousin's computer is broken. It's it can't start up. We got it to work on time, but then it didn't, and then it wouldn't start up again. So I'm also making videos to his channel and. It got partnered. The only thing we need to do is sign the what's called the contract, and then wait a month or some weeks. So 
and then partner. Yay! So that's that's actually pretty good. I think. Yeah, it is. That's a constraint. These are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate. Yes. All right, Desmond. Follow the on-screen instructions. Come here. Fill the two Templars. Assassination. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, All you have to do here is jump the gap. Jump the gap. Oh shit. Okay, no. <sighs> jump. Let's go up and how long time is there left? Three, about three minutes. And I really love the game. I just think this game is completely. I'm addicted. I'm just addicted. Addict, addict, addicted to this game. Oh. Good now. I should be I, able to build the world. Time to find out what his name is. Oh yeah, it's Hatham. Yes, yes, everything is alright. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Don't forget your invitation. But yeah, um, I really Thank you. wanted to make Front of the opera house. a gameplay be before because I was I like be for I'll about, I don't know, I got this game for about a week ago but at the time it was lagging like crazy. Even if I didn't record and I said I just don't want to make gameplay without that and also, the game was on Danish, so Invitation, I please. couldn't like I it was. Coat, then I think it was stupid to do, to make a gameplay with it on Danish because then you couldn't understand the thing, and I have to do a lot of stuff to make it go back to English because you can't just go into settings and then press go on languages. Or you can't go on languages, languages, but Ladies then you. Choose um, subtitles, I think. Yeah, subtitles. And that's not what I want, but I have to reinstall the game. I thought that would work and then take the um, installation guide on English and that, <laughs> that still make it on Danish. And then I uninstalled again, installed it, and then I couldn't even open the game and all that. But that was pretty annoying. So. About one minute back, you can just enjoy this theater. Evening, Haytham. Ah, hello. Reginald. Reginald. Okay, yes. Gaze. Gaze was best work. <laughs> 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 best work. <laughs> yeah, gaze are pretty good I stuff. Love it. But whatever. I don't think, no, even if I have. All the graphics are on the lowest. I think the graphics are <laughs> unbelievable. Unbelievable. Fucking unbelievable. Except they are. Be seated in one of the boxes above. The stairs are watched. You'll need to find another way up. Yes, let's go that way. Up those stairs. Yes, yes. Right, the time is over. I need to end up this episode here. So let me do that. And so I will see you guys in episode 2, part 2. Tomorrow maybe? I will maybe... No, not tomorrow, but... Yeah, tomorrow I will upload that. Or maybe t this evening. So in the next episode we will go up those stairs. And that's a dangerous part of the game so see you guys next time bye